Imagine a world where your smartphone touchscreen never breaks. Instead, it bends. And the antenna inside, so fast it can transfer a terabit of data in a second. And the battery so powerful, it can fly an airplane. What if I told you there was one substance that could make all of this possible? This is graphene, the miracle material of the future. Scientists say it's the thinnest, lightest, and strongest stable material known on Earth. It's so strong, it's up to 200 times stronger than steel and harder than diamond. It's so light that if you had a sheet of graphene the size of a football field, you could hold it between your thumb and finger and it wouldn't bend or break. And it's so thin, it's just one atom thick. That's right, graphene is the world's first two-dimensional material. How is this even possible? For decades, scientists weren't even sure that it was, until 2004 when physicists examined a piece of scotch tape used to peel off thin layers of carbon from a slab of graphite. What they discovered was graphene, a single layer of carbon atoms arranged in a honeycomb pattern which gave the material extraordinary properties. It's transparent, but it can absorb light. It's elastic and pliable, but also impermeable to all gases and liquids except for water. And it's the world's best conductor of heat and electricity. This could lead to faster computer chips, longer-lasting batteries, wearable solar panels. Imagine battery-powered electric airplanes, cancer-detecting nanosensors, unlimited supplies of cheap desalinated ocean water. The possibilities are limitless. So what's stopping us? A flake of graphene just a micrometer thick can cost over $1,000 to make using the scotch tape method, making it possibly the most expensive man-made material on Earth. Another problem? Regular graphene lasts what's called a band gap, the property that allows it to function as a switch. You want your devices to turn on and off. It'll likely take a large company with deep pockets to solve these problems. Until then, Graphene's applications are limited to things like tennis rackets, skis, and light bulbs. Not exactly game-changing. But it's only been about a decade since Graphene was discovered. Since then, labs and companies have poured billions into research in a race to unlock Graphene's limitless potential. Only time will tell if the miracle material of the future ever arrives.